Murder on call with the fight now. Twenty years in the same like a lifetime. I've been hanging every day from a lifeline. So I'd say probably last time everybody seen the truck was put together. But we decided to tear it down, tear it apart and everything because I had went and bought a parts truck. Now when I bought this truck, it was a 79 F100. Had a 302 in it. Tore it down, sold a bunch of parts off of it. Got the parts I need off of it. Took the doors and everything. This whole thing's just completely gutted. And what I've been doing since then was kind of taking everything useful from it and putting it to my truck. I got a good radiator out of it, the front clip, the headlights, pieces, I got another door. I got one door already took off and sanded it down and everything put back on. I got to do this door next, I'm working on getting the hood primed. We got new starter in there got to replace the gasket on that we got this inner fender that's good i'm working on the other inner fender over there this door sand it down and everything i'm gonna take off all the trim sand it down put some bondo over all the little dents we got to put the interior piece back on And then get tags and everything and they'll be road ready we've got both these fenders primered and ready for some bondo and touch up work as you can see this one it's got a crack in it so we're gonna have to fix that up and then this is the other inner fender I've been working on painting it just got a little bit left over here and then we're gonna let that dry finish up sanding the other door and then hopefully put everything back together. We got radiator bushings and everything. JD's working on his own project over here. If you want to go check out what he's doing to the Jeep. Gleetus Customs. And I'll put a link to that down in the description. We just finished up the paint on the inner fender. I'm gonna let that dry. And then I'm gonna help JD for a little bit and then start sanding on the other door and then maybe eventually we'll get to put the fenders back on Luann over there. God. We almost got the new header gasket on. We got all the bolts in except for this last one is just being a pain. So we're gonna see if we can get that on then do the emblems on his Jeep and we might put this fender back on or we might just put the inner fender on this side so finally got the header bolts in now we're just working on putting this inner fender on it's just these three bolts and then this one bolt down here and that's all that holds it up we got the front clip going on Right here, the inner fender slides up underneath. I don't know if you can see the gap or not. It slides into there on each side. And then it has this hole in the bottom. And you put these rubber bushings through it. Once you do that, you just tighten them down and your front clip's on there. We got the bolts down through there. And it comes out to here. Got it on both sides, but I'm just going to be a stopping point for today because the sun's going down. One thing I want to point out there's a brand new water pump, Master Cylinder, already rusted. It's ridiculous. <laughs> 